Hey guys, I'm showing you some rafter hacks. Uh, so what I'm doing here is uh, copying some guy on uh, YouTube. He takes the strap and uh, connects it on here. So this is gonna kind of damage the end. Like on this one, I did it. You see, it's kind of like a like it really digs in there a little bit. But you're gonna cover that anyway with the the fascia or whatever. Um, so it digs in there, and if you hold this down as you're tightening it, uh, it'll, it'll tend to go up. So just hold it down. And uh, the reason I'm doing this, I'll show you, is uh, like right here, it's hard to cut this perfectly straight. So I got a bit of a gap, but on this side, it's, it's, it's tight, right? Um, so you can play around to get that straight, but uh, that's what I do. I grind it with a rasp. I'll show you in a minute. But on the problem for this one, same as that other one, was that when I cut it, even though it was the proper length, it was uh, not fitting perfectly. Oh shoot, the bumblebee. Uh, it wasn't per fitting perfectly to my uh, ridge beam. So this one is nice and tight now because I, I tightened this strap uh, quite a bit. It's, it's pretty tight, so just be careful. Uh, see, uh, I just wrapped around the beam here. So what I'm doing is I'm forcing the beam to the side of the shed. And uh, that eliminated the gap, surprisingly, because uh, there was, even though it was a perfect fit, just wasn't fitting right. Uh, you can try stuff like that, but uh, that one I might change, because that, that looks kind of ugly. Like I stuck pieces of wood into the gap. So uh, I'm gonna probably fix that one. Oh damn, there's a massive bee here. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna show you some other stuff with these, uh, Hurricane ties you can use. Uh, you can use that, uh, like right there, or on the on the outside if you want. So I might put these. Uh, probably put those. That's for extra, you know. But what I'm doing is because I have a single top plate, I'm screwing right from the bottom, so it's pretty good. Uh, so you can also get these. These are uh, the, this one was a dollar in Canada, Ontario. This one was two dollars. So with these, you can install your rafters. But I'm going to show you a problem with these things. Gotta move the water. Okay. So the problem is, is that if you install these, it's a nice fit, but you're going to have to find screws that are not going to come out the other side. And you're, it's going to be a lot of work, same as these ones over here. And you're going to screw from both sides. Uh, you're going to have to find very small screws, kind of. And otherwise it's going to be a mess. Like, uh, you won't be able to use 3-inch screws on this. But with uh, my 3-inch screws, I'm just screwing from uh, one from there, kind of like at an angle, and two from there. So that should be enough. Uh, won't need because this is two dollars. You don't really need this. I'm not gonna use that. Maybe just put one. I bought two of these just to check it out. But uh, yeah, this 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 will take a lot more work to uh, nail this stuff or screw it. And uh, you won't be if you nail it, you won't be able to take it apart. If you have to move your shed, so that's why I also have the screws. So this is a, a very rigid. You can't move it. It's a very rigid fit. So um, I might also put like. Um, a two by four going across here from one end to the other and maybe support it or something maybe put a hurricane tie or I could even put maybe a hurricane tie, tie right here let's see if I can fit it on so if I put the hurricane tie right here it's only like a dollar so that'll fit uh, pretty good right here, like perfectly. So I don't know if there's a point to that though. Uh, probably there's no point to this. Um, so I was done over here. So there, there's the strap. So I'm just tightening it across on either side. Wherever I got space, so that that is really a, a, a good hack, uh, is a, I noticed. Because if you have a tiny gap, you won't you won't be able to do nothing about it. 
uh, unless you use a strap like this. Okay, guys, thanks for watching.